My name is Arpenik. Um, I was born in a beautiful country of Armenia from a capital, Yerevan. I am a cellist and a vocalist for Axel. I am the cellist that Axel painted in his image of how he saw the cellist. And I must say, I really truly believe that he really painted me when he did so because of the character. You'll see what it looks like. We have become a family. We're practically all married to each other without the marriage, basically. So our days is morning, breakfast um, or coffee. Good morning. And then practice together, take a break together, <laughs> and then eat lunch together. And then after you're done eating lunch together, you know, everybody goes, does their workout, blah, blah, blah. And then we in the evening again together because we eat together in the evening most of the time. Well, we have Arpanik like cooking some incredible chicken over here. We'll, well, we'll see, see you when the food is ready. And sometimes if it's a weekend, I will take my, um, you know, I will take stroll somewhere. I will go discover the city. Every Sunday, it's a habit now. I make it to be possible to go out. So I am in the woods, as you can see around me. It is just green, green, green. For me as a cellist, I definitely have to warm my fingers up. So before we start the rehearsals, usually I will play David Popper. Like I will play very classically, very challenging studies. Everybody knows, like, ah, Arpenik is starting again. You know, it's like, da -da 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 -da, you know. For my playing, obviously, just something to warm my fingers up. And for the vocals, and all of that, you know, you know the thrill. <laughs> It's challenging that I want to now skate on the top of that. I'm learning, I'm taking lessons, and it's, it's getting better and better and better. But you know how they say you have to work so hard before you can actually feel comfortable doing something that you're just learning. I was born to a family of an actress. I grew up in the theater backstage. I am a theater child. Tell me when will you be mine? I don't know. Tell me Gwanda, Gwanda, Gwanda. I don't know when. Everything that I knew my whole life was related to art, to stage. So it, it is the very natural form of habitat for me to be in around the actors or performers of such nature. And I also grew up uh, doing a little bit of a drama education myself as well. But then I have always been a musician from a very young age, so... I've always known that I would be a musician. I wanted to be many other things as well because I believed that I could. But every single path always led me back to music. I must say that I'm, a, I'm one of those people that tried many different things while I also grew up playing music professionally. But then anything I did, I stopped and I came back to music. And then when I got my professional uh, graduate and master's degree in music, that's how I st stuck to music. And I knew that's it. This is it. My favorite part is that I get to play and sing together on, at the same time, which is something that I just love to do. We have a very, very good connection, all of us together. I must say that we have a very good band leader and constantly it is, um, if we are not laughing, smiling, playing a passage, we're communicating about something. I would say that we are just having lots of fun when we are doing this and you can come in, if you come in during the rehearsal, you will see, you know, there's a passage, somebody's making a really funky face and the other one is laughing and it's an interaction. So if I had to describe Axel in three words, it would have been mysterious, it would have been fascinating, and it would have been very intimate.